Hello, everyone. We've got Mr. Noble in his new harness. He's like, look at how styling I am in my Snoopy harness. I think we're going to have to get him the next size up, too. But this one's okay for now. Noble loves peas organic. <laughs> Noble, I'm going to get you your peas. Oh, he's like my peas. He's going to come. Come, Noble. Oh, good boy. Oh, you dig them out of the grass? You dig them out of the grass? What is you doing? I think you're a redhead. He's like, oh my gosh, I don't know if I like this harness yet. But if you keep giving me peas, I may be agreeable. <laughs> if you keep giving me some peas, I may agree. You want to go for a little walk? Okay, come on. Now that I gave you peas. Come on, good boy. He's actually a Juliana. That's the breed of pig. Uh, and he also, there's another breed also that he is. So he's a Juliana pig for the most part. And um, that they're just a smaller breed of pig in general. So they're not like the huge hogs. They just get to be normally between uh, 30 and 50 pounds on average. So he's a little guy though right now. He's only about four pounds, aren't you? See, I've been getting lots of veggies and fruits. Oh, the grass is good, isn't it? <laughs> okay, you want some more peas? Let's see if I can bribe you with some peas. He's like, you have peas? I can smell it. Oh, he's coming. Good boy. Come on. Come on. Good boy. Oh, he's like, those are delicious organic peas. They are so good. They are so good. They are so, so good. You, you, you sampling the clovers? You sampling the clovers? Okay, come on. He's getting used to the harness. He did not like putting it on. He screeched. But I was warned that would happen, that that's normal when you initially put the harness on them. Hey, yo. Want to say hi to everyone? Say hi. <laughs> oh, here's I come. <laughs> so we're going to start training him. Good boy. I'm training him to follow me, actually. Come on, good boy. Come on. He's like, oh, this is so much fun. I'm beginning to get the hang of this harness business. Oh, you had to scratch. Do you got any peas? <laughs> okay, let's go get you some peas. He's like, I know you have them up there. I'm very smart. Noble has smarticle particles in his brain. They actually have the intelligence of a four-year-old child. Come here, Noble. You want peas? Say, do I want peas? Do I want peas? Oh, my gosh. Close up. Close up. <laughs> so we'll be doing quite a few videos with Noble. And uh, he's enjoying himself, as you can see by the tail wag. We're trying to get him some exercise because uh, right now the dogs and him are still getting used to each other. So we have them separated. So we want to make sure he begins to come outside, learn the property. So when he gets older, he can come outside. Right, bud? He goes, those peas are vintage, aren't they? Those are good. <laughs> come on. Nobo, come on. <laughs> he really likes the phone. When I put the phone down, he goes right for it. Are you looking for truffles? See, I might be on the hunt for some truffles. They actually train pigs to look for truffles, which are a uh, very expensive type of mushroom. Good boy. Come on. This is your exercise program. If you want peas, you've got to exercise. 
Good boy. Come on. Yeah, you have to make sure they can't get out of the harness. So here's the little house I got for the kittens who will be going to the rescue shortly. But that's their little house. Noble may want to go check it out. Maybe it'll become your outdoor house too, Noble. He's like, up, oh, I'm embarking onto new territory now. I haven't gone this far yet, and I'm embarking. <laughs> oh, he found something. Are you foraging? Yes, he's foraging. Come on. Let's go. Let's see if we can get you by the house. You want to come on the house? No. They have a very good sense of smell. Okay. What? Okay. So I think we'll say goodbye for now, right? He's going to say goodbye to everybody, Noble. Say, see you soon.